Yes. Hi, Maggie. Brady and I are over here at the one of the Meridian locations of Albertsons. We're at the one specifically on Eagle Road and Amity right now. And you can see right now we are inside the store and we're going to talk about maybe some of the food donations that we can offer for Seven Cares Idaho Shares. We're also accepting those cash donations and everything goes towards helping nine different nonprofits in our community. Yeah, absolutely. Really nice to take a break from the cold. You know, as a former Albertsons employee, I like to feel like I'm an expert on this sort of thing. Well, we're here with an actual expert, Megan from the Idaho Food Bank. She's going to tell us, you know, what are what are the good products that you can buy while you're getting your groceries today and, and donate? What goes the furthest? I see you got two items in your hand right here. Yeah, absolutely. So really today we're focused on those non-perishable items. So some awesome choices are um, any sort of canned fruit or vegetable, any sort of whole grain pasta or rice. Uh, I'm a dietitian, so I always always like to highlight our focus on nutritious foods. Um, so 85% of the food that we distributed last year actually was nutritious. So this is a great part or a great opportunity for the community to really be part of that. Yeah, absolutely. And um, you, you said non-perishable as, as an emphasis. So what are, what are some foods maybe people should stray away from and what should they get instead? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so maybe instead of those uh, fresh produce items some of the canned items are will work a little bit better for today um, and then we always accept fresh produce at our warehouse too wonderful and you talked a little bit about how the need has changed a little bit this year can you talk about what the need is specifically like for this year Absolutely. So we know that about 9% of Idahoans are uh, expected to experience food insecurity this year, and that includes 10.5% of Idaho's children. Um, so I think we all know that's just too many. Uh, the good news is we have seen that decline from the height of the pandemic, but I think everybody's feeling the, you know, the rising costs in food and gas and housing. Um, we know that all adds up. So this is a great opportunity to help people feel a little bit of extra hope during the holiday season. Exactly. And the Idaho Food Bank is just one of the nine nonprofits that this event goes to help. So if you'd like to help, it definitely goes a long way in the community. And Megan, really quick follow up question for you. Even if someone can only make a small donation, would you say that that still helps? Even if it's a few things from their pantry, does that help our community? Oh, my gosh. Yes, it helps tremendously. Every every little bit really helps. Um, we know that the need is out there. We know that there's a lot of people who are experiencing food insecurity this year. So thank you all so much for just your participation and your support. We know it goes a long ways. Yeah, and Brady, we did see one donation that came up right before we walked in the store. So thank you so much to everybody who has come out and given us these donations. We've seen lots of people come by. So it's definitely great to see all this, right? Absolutely. And I want to mention before we uh, toss it back, you know, the check lines right now are very short. So this is a great opportunity right now to come in, get your grocery shopping done for the week, and then, you know, pick up a couple extra items, some cans of uh, beans, some pasta, and, you know, Take the time real quickly, really easy to go give back to members of this community. Again, we're at the Albertsons on the uh, corner of Eagle and Amity. Mm -hmm. uh, and there are plenty of other Albertsons locations and Fred Meyer locations throughout the Treasure Valley that you can also donate to. Yeah, and specifically we're in aisle three right now and pretty much anything in aisle three is gonna be those non-perishable goods. So come on out to aisle three, Albertsons at Eagle Road and Amity. You will see us here. We're right out in the parking lot. There's definitely separate entrances for that. So you don't have to worry about a backup so that we will be here ready to take your donation. Now I'll go ahead and send things back to you guys.